Hey, welcome back to Kelly Drives. This next spot has plenty of board games where you can go take the family or your friends. Come on, let's go play. Twister, Scrabble, Monopoly, all the classics. But there's a whole new world of board games that you can try for free at the Philly Game Shop. Wow, you have it all from playing cards to Uno to dice to games I've never even heard before. Mm -hmm. How did you get into the game business? Oh my gosh, well, I'm a lifelong nerd, so I really loved games my whole life, and I didn't really have a way to make it my livelihood growing up. I also didn't feel like necessarily included in the gaming community growing up. There were a lot of clubhouses, and okay. this is our kind of attempt to make a game place, game shop that can be for everyone, where anyone can feel like they can just sit down and play games with anyone anytime. But so how does it work? If you want to, you can buy a game, sit down and play. You could bring your own game, it doesn't cost you anything. Mm -hmm. Or you could pay $5 and rent from our demo library all day long and play as many games as you want and just hang out. I thought I had it all with like Monopoly, Clue, the game of life. Is there a particular category that you would say is the most popular right now? Oh gosh, well, I think trading cards are the most popular right now. Trading cards, yeah. okay. Magic the Gathering, Pokemon, Lorcana, the new Disney game. Pokemon's still around? Pokemon is going strong. This is a hot potato game for kids. It's kind of goofy. It's kind of gross. Uh, where you're just trying to be the last person standing and not get stuck with the exploding kitten. Oh, I remember Classic. this one. Mousetrap. Oh, my gosh. More fun to set up than anything, don't you think? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> you want to set got, it off. You got Jenga, Kenneck 4. Mm-hmm. They invite you to stay a while. Some chips and some snacks. Oh, look, you have a whole section of Dungeons & Dragons. Oh, man, I love Dungeons & Dragons. It's one of my favorite games. I've been playing it since high school. Not a wow, so you have a little bit of everything here. We do. So it's not just D&D. We have a lot of, actually, indie tabletop games. So there are a lot of books that came out since Dungeons & Dragons. So this one is another local-made game where everyone is a princess, and you go and save the day together. Here, this is the Race to Stupid. This is a woman-produced Hey, is game. this for me? I mean, it's for me, too. Oh, okay. It's about making up facts. Wow, a wall of games here. Yeah, these are the ones that you can buy. These are all the brand new titles. We've got about 500 board game titles here. Really? Oh, yeah. Wow. And we try to make sure that there's a bit of something for everyone. So we've got fantasy games, we've got science games, we've got mystery games, we've got battle games. We try to have a bit of everything. Our goal with this game shop was to create a space that was inclusive to everyone. That's why you see rainbows all over the place. We want to broadcast that this is the kind of place anyone could walk into, feel welcome, feel safe, feel at home. I never heard of this one, Fog of Love. What's this about? Oh, gosh. This is a dating simulator, actually. It's a 1v1 game where you don't play yourself. You're playing other characters and trying to find out if their relationship is going to work out based on who these people are that you're playing. You can't play yourself or else you might not win this game. And you don't always stay together either. Sometimes <laughs> relationships are supposed to end. Right, what's this one here, Flamecraft? Oh, yes. This is one of my new favorites. This is like a little dragon economy game where each of these people are trying to play down shops and send their dragons to shops to collect resources to be the most um, effective dragon shopkeeper. This one never stays on the shelf. In fact, I think we might be out of it right now. So whether you're looking to play old classics like Jenga or one of the new ones like Flamecraft, the Philly Game Shop, it's a place to go. 